Hello guys, my name is Bob. In this video, I'm going to show you the solution to the integration problem, which is the integral from 0 to pi over 2 of ln bracket tangent x dx. The first thing we do is to split this integral out into two integrals. So the first integral will be from 0 to pi over 4 of ln tangent x dx. While the second integral we focus on okay is from pi over 4 to pi over 2 of ln tangent x dx we now focus on the second integral and we perform the u substitution okay by letting Um, x is equivalent to pi over 2 minus y. So when we differentiate, we expect to y, we will get negative 1. And hence, dx is equivalent to negative dy. Okay, so the integral from pi over 4 to pi over 2 of ln tangent x uh, dx, this is equivalent to now. We know x is now equals to pi over 2 minus y is equals to pi over 4. And we do the same thing on the upper limit of the integral. And the inter portion of the function, which is the function, is just ln bracket tangent uh, bracket pi over 2 minus y. dx is negative dy. So this is equivalent to when we make y the subject, that would be y is equivalent to pi over 4. Or well, the upper limit is y is equals to 0. Of ln bracket tangent bracket pi over 2 minus y bracket negative dy. As the upper limit is lower than the lower limit of the integral, we have to switch it around. So as we switch it around, we will get the negative sign in front of the integral of from y equals to 0 to y equals to pi over 4. And this follows. All right. And we have now two positive sign multiplying each other okay is equals two negative sign multiplying each other is equals to the positive sign and hence we have this equation next we will focus on is this function which is the tangent pi over 2 minus y okay tangent pi over 2 minus y is equivalent to sine bracket pi over 2 minus y over cosine pi over 2 minus y. The next step after this, we will use the trigonometry's addition formula. So the additional formula tells us that um, sine bracket alpha minus beta is equivalent to sine alpha cosine beta minus cosine alpha sine beta while the cosine of alpha minus beta is equivalent to cosine alpha cosine beta plus sine alpha sine beta okay we now let alpha be equivalent to pi over 2 and beta be equivalent to y and this whole equation can simply be equivalent to using the addition formula it's just sine pi over 2 cosine y subtracting away the cosine of pi over 2 sine y divided by the cosine of pi over 2 um, the cosine of y plus sine of 
pi over 2 sine of y. We now know that sine pi over 2 is equivalent to 1 because sine pi over 2 is equivalent to 0. So basically this term is just 0. This term is also 0. Well, we know this is 1, this is 1, and this whole fraction can be simplified to just cosine y over sine y, which is also equivalent to cotangent of y, and then equivalent to 1 over tangent of y. So substituting this answer into this function, we have the integral, okay, from 0 to pi over 4 of ln bracket, okay, 1 over tangent y, dy, which is equivalent to 0 to pi over 4 of negative ln tangent y, dy, okay. So now we come back to here okay now we have simplified the second integral so this whole thing can be equivalent to the integral from 0 to pi over 4 of ln tangent x dx plus the integral from 0 to pi over 4 when we derive the second integral as this which is negative ln bracket tangent y dy all right for the second integral basically we let y equals to x and bring out the negative sign of the integral so we get the integral from 0 to power 4 of ln tangent x dx subtracting away the integral from 0 to power 4 of ln uh, tangent x dx okay and this is just nice zero okay so basically my answer okay of the integral from zero to power over two of ln tangent x dx is equivalent to zero and that's the answer to this question thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next video if you like this video do like or subscribe to the channel